when you go closer like that, it looks, yeah. Okay. Hey, everybody. Welcome. Welcome to Glam It Up tonight, you guys. We are here. We're excited to be here tonight. Um, okay. We popped on here just about a minute early. So we're going to check and make sure we're in the right group. <laughs> so if you guys want to grab your phone, you can go check us on. I'm going to check us out on YouTube and make sure we're popping up and make sure we're, oh, we're on YouTube. Okay. We're good there. Sweet. Okay. Let me put that on. Okay. And then make sure we're in Freedom Achievers, Pink Power and Possibilities. And if you guys have anybody that you want to go in and start tagging, I'm going to tag a couple people real fast. All right. If you hop on here, if you, as you join us, you guys, make sure and comment with your name that you are here. Hi, Sandra. <laughs> okay, awesome, awesome. All right, well, I hope you guys are ready for Glam It Up tonight. And while we're all just kind of getting into the group here, getting situated, finding our groove, making sure we're in the right place, <laughs> and you guys are commenting that you're here, we're going to introduce um, a couple people here because, as you guys notice, I'm not by myself tonight. I am so excited to have two awesome guests with us tonight. Um, and these ladies were like overly excited, right, to jump in. And <laughs> um, really excited about this. <laughs> yeah, they, are, they love color. They love color. So they were super thrilled um, to be able to join us tonight. So you guys go ahead and um, introduce yourselves to us real quickly and just tell us who you are. Tell us, of course, where you're, where you're from. Tell us where you live. Tell us how long you've been building your Mary Kay business and maybe just one quick thing that you love most about your business. So. so I am Dodie Johnson and I am um, calling, I'm actually here live, <laughs> from Michigan and I've been in Mary Kay for four and a half years and I just love um, the sisterhood of the company. Sweet, sweet, sweet. And Dodie is our gorgeous glamour girl. <laughs> she can wear every color and it looks amazing on her. <laughs> Love it. So you guys are going to get to watch her in action tonight. All right. Go, yeah. Lauren. I bet a lot of us could wear a lot more colors than we think we could. Sure. Dodie just rocks it because she's got the confidence. <laughs> um, okay. I am Lauren and my internet is not the best. So I'm so sorry if I cut out a little bit tonight, <laughs> but um, I'm here in Krugerville, Texas, which is basically Aubrey and they are bringing better internet. It's supposed to be here any day now. <laughs> I'm like waiting for it. Um, anyway, so I've been um, building my business for seven years and um, something that I love about it is that it gives me this great opportunity to reconnect or stay connected with people from my past and um it just pushes me to meet new people and um otherwise i think i would be a hermit <laughs> and so i love that that it um you know like gives me opportunity it gives yeah and awesome. and i am i do love color and i'm really excited about the palette and i love teaching and so i'm excited to show you all what i've been like playing around with and what i've learned how to do sweet 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 so you guys are definitely in a treat for Lauren. She's She loves to learn. And um, I love it because she puts that into action. And so she was on an amazing glamour workshop. <laughs> and so she put some of those tips right into play. So I'm excited for her to share some of those with you guys tonight as well. Mm -hmm. All right. I was putting in the comments, you guys. Tell us who your beauty consultant is. If you are a freedom achiever, start tagging your customers. Start tagging your friends that are inside our group. And then just tag them, tag them, tag them. And then uh, we'll keep going. And as they join now, great. Um, as they join for rewatch, replay, that works as well. As well. So I'm gonna. Let, um, we're gonna let Dodie and Lauren kind of go off screen, but uh, we will see them again in a little while. So that way they don't have to be here just kind of you know hanging out while we're doing all the beginning part. <laughs> so we will see you guys in just a little bit. <laughs> 
Okay. Awesome. Awesome. Well, we have a great night lined up for you guys, but before we get going, we've got lots of announcements and just some things that we need, need to do to get the, the ball rolling. So first of all, we have our comment bag, you guys. We've got lots of great things we want to give away tonight. So remember to comment, comment, comment. <laughs> so if you are not a Mary Kay Beauty consultant, so we've got one. Hi, Sarah. Glad you are here. Sarah's already commented with who her beauty consultant is. So Sarah, your name is going on a ticket and it's going into our comment bag. So we will be drawing from these red tickets. See, there's a name on the oop, upside down, Sarah, going in the comment bag. So lots and lots of comments get you into our comment giveaway. <laughs> so if you are a beauty, consul uh, beauty consultant, tag, chit chat with us, all that great stuff. But our guest will go into the comment bag, okay? As we move along tonight, though, if you see a product that you're like, sold, I totally need that, <laughs> or I totally want that, definitely comment the word sold in the comments. Um, and then your name will actually get entered into our bag that says sold. And that way your beauty consultant knows that you are interested in that product and she will do an excellent job of touching out or reaching out to you um, in order to get you the product that you have heard about tonight and that you wanna to add to your bathroom, <laughs> okay? So make sure and put sold when you hear something that you're like, gotta have that, and a post sold, and we'll get you added into our sold comment, and um, we will uh, get you into that, that giveaway as well. Okay, ask questions, you guys, ask us questions. Tonight is all about glamour, and so as our gals are doing their eye looks tonight, ask them questions so that they can talk and answer those questions while they are doing their um, their eyes tonight, <laughs> okay? And then last but not least, so, so keep commenting, comment, comment, comment. Um, and last but not least, I think most of you guys, oh, this is awesome, y'all. Y'all are all popping up except for Nicole. <laughs> and Nicole, Nicole, you're a, a beauty consultant. Um, but you guys, go ahead. And if you, if you um, well, like I said, most of y'all are all popping up except for Nicole. So we want to see your comments. <laughs> Grant StreamYard permission by clicking above uh, where it says StreamYard.com backslash Facebook. Click again so that you can let StreamYard see your live comments, okay? And if you are a guest, you can totally tag your friends. So if you've got friends um, that you're like, oh my gosh, so-and-so would love to learn glamour tips, tag her right now in the comments. And for every person that you tag, that counts as a comment and we'll add you to our comment. Um, I was about to say comment jar, but it's a comment bag. <laughs> we'll add you to the bag. All right, Sarah, do you have the map I got from you and show you how to activate it? Girl, we'll do that after the session. <laughs> Sarah, tonight is all about glamour, uh, but I would love to show you how to activate your hydra, um, your hydrating mask. That is amazing, amazing mask. <laughs> all right, well, thank you guys for being on tonight, all of our guests, all of our beauty consultants. So I just want to uh, remind everybody, first of all, as beauty consultants, this is a night for y'all to learn learn tips, learn glamour tips so that you can go immediately, put those into action. Um, I know that that was a special part that I had to learn along the way. I'm still learning how to do glamour techniques. <laughs> Always need the help. Um, but this is a training night for you guys. So you get to product knowledge and get to learn about the products, how to apply more of our products. Um, but our customers that are on here, our friends, you guys, we appreciate you guys. We appreciate you guys. And of course, if it wasn't for y'all, we would not have a business. <laughs> we love our customers. And if it wasn't for y'all, we would not be here and we wouldn't be able to do our job. So we appreciate you guys. Thank you guests for being on tonight. Um, and I also want you to know that your beauty consultant works hard. Like she, she shows up, she gets educated, she works hard. And so um, you're helping her with her individual goals. And then by helping her to her goals, you're helping our team goal this year. So y'all ready? You are helping our team, the Freedom Achievers, um, go all the way to a million in retail sales. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Whether you buy one thing from us this year or you buy a thousand things from us this year, you are helping us to that big, huge goal. So we appreciate you. <laughs> so thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so tonight, um, let me. we're going to go through just a couple things um, uh, as far as what was on our flyer, a couple of things about why choose Mary Kay products. And, uh, and then we're going to get started on our eye looks, okay? We're going to give you guys two eye, different eye looks tonight. 
And then uh, we're also, uh, Dodie's going to come back at the end, you guys. And we're going to, it's all about the, the palette tonight, you guys. All about our warm hue palette. And uh, let me give you a quick up close personal look at it. Of course, this is my personal one. That's why you see the little, <laughs> I guess I probably should have got a new one, but this is mine. And um, Dodie is going to actually round us up tonight, showing us how to use this whole palette for your whole entire face, for contouring cheeks and your eyes, okay? So when you leave tonight, this could be your one pocket, throw it in your purse, take it everywhere you go, and this is all you need to do your whole glam, okay? Now you did see maybe at the bottom of our flyer for tonight, the chance to win a cash giveaway for a $500 or $1,000 cash giveaway. Did anybody see that? Cash? <laughs> Did anybody see that at the bottom of the flyer? A chance to win or to, uh, yeah, it's actually to win $500 cash giveaway or a $1,000 cash giveaway is at the very bottom of our invite, okay? So I wanted to guys, let you guys know that that is a contest that Corporate Mary Kay is doing, okay? Um, oh, Action Park, I need to put my, uh, there's my thank you. I had a thank you post for y'all <laughs> for helping us with our goal. And I'm just moving right along here. Okay. Um, all right. Moving. So thank you. I'll tell y'all again. Thank you for helping us to million and retail sell this seminar year. <laughs> all right. Moving on to the makeover contest, though. The Uniquely Hue makeover contest. It does run till the end of September. So ask your beauty consultant. Let her know. Post it in the comments right now. In fact, that could be a comment. I want to enter. Enter me. Enter me to win. Cash. <laughs> um, put some comments in there and you guys can um, be a part of that. But you're going to get with your beauty consultant. You're going to do a makeover. Take a before and an after picture, submit it up to our Uniquely You. Um, they have a whole just uh, a website page dedicated to the contest. You can see all the before and after pictures that are already uploaded. And um, as long as yours gets there, by September 30th, you'll be entered. And then it's actually going to be voting. Like you get to vote and uh, others around you can vote for the best in the, the, I don't know, the best or the one that's the most different. Um, but it's going to be public voting and you can have a chance to win $500 cash or a thousand thousand dollars cash. Whoa. Okay. So get excited. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Sarah wants to be entered. Frances, she has commented again and make sure and get her, um, we have to get you a color card girl and get a before and after picture. All right. So I want to make sure you guys know about that. And especially after watching tonight, you're going to be all excited about glamour and you're going to want to enter that contest. Okay. Moving on. Um, let's move on to choosing to purchase Mary Kay. You are making a difference. First of all, I want you guys to know that when you choose to wear Mary Kay products, you are helping 5,000 other Americans work <laughs> with jobs and an employment. Is that not amazing? And that is not counting us as beauty consultants. That is everybody around that it takes to package to make our products, to ship our products, but over 5,000 jobs working Americans when you choose to purchase Mary Kay. We're also environmentally friendly. We planted millions of trees, and um, that's a huge part of um, just pink doing green. Also, we have a zero landfill. Um, we're also our Mary Kay Charitable Foundation is in place, you guys. Um, over 30 million has been given for research, development, finding cures for women's cancers. And over 82 million uh, donated for domestic violence. We fund at least one shelter in every state in the United States. And one of my favorite things, you guys, did y'all know, and I think you might have known if you've come to anything before, <laughs> that um, Mary Kay products actually are at the European standard. So here in, the, in America, there's like no FDA regulation on skincare products. Um, but there are some ingredients that are, that are banned. Um, I think here in the United States, we banned is it 500, 600-ish ingredients? And over in Europe, you guys, they actually banned over 1,200 ingredients. All Mary Kay products go by European standards. Whoa! So get excited that we don't put any of those 1,200 ingredients in any of our products. So rest assured, you are using the best, okay? So guests that are on here, um, whether you're here or if you're on YouTube, post in the comments which one of those is your favorite? Like which one hits home to you the most? And even Freedom Achievers, you guys post which one that you love the most. Is it the 5,000 American workers? Is it the environmentally friendly? All of our trees that we've been planted? Is it pink doing green? Is it the charitable foundation? 
or is it that European standard of excellence <laughs> with our products? <laughs> um, sometimes it's a little hard to pick, but pick the one that hits the closest to you. Thank you, Sarah, for posting that. Appreciate it, girl. Okay, so um, there you go. A little bit about why choose Mary Kay. All right, love that, love that. Next, moving on, I do want to share with you guys, you can actually start a Mary Kay business for $30. <laughs> and I do have a, a third bag here that says sign me up. So if you watch us tonight, you're like, uh, this is kind of cool. Uh, this is this is kind of neat. I would learn to learn a little bit, I'd love to learn a little bit more. I think I might want to try this. You can be a sign me up girl. <laughs> and uh, you can put sign me up in the comments and we will put your name in our sign me up bag. And um, we do have a special treat for our sign me up. Actually, Mary Kay has a great treat. Every beauty consultant that comes on board here in September, when they place their first active order here in September or October, y'all, they get a free Skin Vigorate brush. Ah, Skin Vigorate brush, y'all. That's a $75. It's the, bzz, I meant to grab mine and I don't have one in here, but it's awesome. Every woman needs a Skin Vigorate brush. <laughs> uh, but you need that to wash your face with, but that's yours free, complimentary, because you became a sign me up girl in the month of September. Okay. So if you decide that this is something, uh, and guys, you could be a savvy shopper and you could sign me up, sign me up as a savvy shopper. Okay. That means you just want to come in and you want to shop at our discount. We'll just put it there. Maybe somebody might have a question, but you might want to shop at our discount. <laughs> okay. But you could be a sign me up savvy shopper. Or you might want to come in and earn a little extra income, maybe an extra $50, $100 a week. And so you could be a um, extra income sign me up girl. Or you might want to be an all out and come in and earn a car, <laughs> um, become a sales director, become a leader, become a red jacket. And you could be an all out sign me up girl. OK, but you can put that in the comments, sign me up and we will add your entry into the sign me up bag. Plus. We have a fun, awesome pearl bracelet here. Woohoo! It's one of our new pearl bracelets. And this is for all of our girls that are a sign me up girl. And they come to an event, they watch a video, they hear our information, and they are a sign me up girl. Within 24 hours, you get our fun pearl bracelet. Okay? Woohoo! Love, love my pearl bracelet, you guys. You need one too. <laughs> All right. So um, there we go. Sign me up. Um, you can start for a $30 e-start. Oh, I forgot to mention one other thing that I think is super duper important. Um, the good housekeeping seal of approval. Mary Kay has it on our products. <laughs> and uh, back up to choosing to purchase Mary Kay. You are making a difference, y'all. Uh, we have multiple products in our lines that have the good housekeeping seal of approval. And y'all, that is a major deal. That just means that, first of all, Mary Kay products are backed by 100% satisfaction guarantee, but with a good housekeeping seal of approval, it's backed up again that our product is going to do what it says it's going to do. So, whoa, so rest assured, when you choose to, make, uh, to purchase Mary Kay, yes, you're making a difference, and yes, you're buying a product that does exactly what it says it's going to do. All right. Awesome. Any questions? Any more comments in here? Okay. Thank you, Sandra, planting trees. Thank you for posting that. Um, your um, one that you like the most. I appreciate that. All right. Any other guests joining us, make sure and comment that you're here. Tell us who your beauty consultant is. Comment, comment, comment. So you can go into our comment bag. And Sarah, I'm getting caught up on your entries. And so are y'all ready? Are y'all ready to get started? Okay, if you have, if you are a beauty consultant and you have your worn use compact, grab it. If you are a customer and you've already got your palette, grab it or grab you a piece of paper and a pen and get ready to take some notes. Okay, so our first um, model that you guys already met, but our first one up is Miss Dodie. So y'all give Dodie a round of applause, lots of love, <laughs> and she's going to take it away. You're muted, Dodie. You're muted. <laughs> I was just going off and talking and nobody could hear. <laughs> I'm so excited to be here to show you guys everything that can happen in this just this one palette. This palette is amazing. Um, and I've been so excited to have this. I've been wearing this almost every single day and just playing around with all the looks. And I'm going to show you a whole look with just these six colors. So let me get started. 
And I am going to um, start with the golden possibilities as just a base um, to kind of brighten up the eye. So I'm going to just do this all over. And what I do, I'm going to tap on the ear. Tap, tap, tap. And this is a shimmer color. And when I put it on, I just kind of pat it on my eyes. I don't want to drag it because it kind of doesn't. You want to set that powder and that color in. This um, palette, the pigment is very, I mean, it's, you can just see it. It has great pigment on there. And when you pat it on, you can just see how it just kind of like sparkles. And I just do it all over the eye so you can immediately see the difference. And it has that sparkle there. So I'm going to pat it on both of the eyes and take my brush. This is my all over brush. And these brushes are really good. They pick up a lot of the product. They pick up a lot of the shadow color. And you don't really have to use so much. Of course, all of our products are very concentrated. And not that this palette is concentrated, but it does. The way that these synthetic bristles are made and the hairs on the bristles, it picks up a lot of the um, shadow. So both eyes. Oh, hopefully you can see those with my lighting. Okay, so I have the golden possibilities on all over. Next, I'm going to actually clean off my brush and I'm going to go in with the purple vibes. One thing about this palette that I really like is that you can literally just use one color or you can use two or three or even four colors um, all together just for one eye. So, or for just, yeah, for your eye look. Um, so because I have hooded eyes, I actually leave my eyes open so I can make sure that when I am looking at someone, you can actually see the colors instead of, you know, hiding it. So I leave my eyes open when I put my shadows on and I'm going on my lid all the way up a little bit to my brow bone. And again, like I said, my eyes are hooded. So I have to make that definition to show um, where that crease is. So I'm going in with the purple vibes. And again, I'm patting on all over my lower lid and a little bit up to the brow bone and not to my arch by my eyebrows because you want to leave that part bright and open. This is a really nice color. It makes my brown eyes look even browner. Um, and you can literally just wear this by itself. And one thing that's in this on trend is just like bold colors. I've been seeing a lot of um, eyeshadows just with one look. You could take the purple vibes or even the, the dream big brown and just like have it deeper here and then take a blending brush and kind of soft, soften it at the top and kind of blend it out. And so that's kind of what I've been doing just so I can show the colors. Um, but I do like the contrast. So right now I'm using my blending brush and I'm just blending these colors together. So they look a little bit more smoother and you don't see any harsh lines. And if you make a mistake, all you do is just use your blending brush or any type of a brush just to keep blending in and it'll it'll all fuse together. I think you can fuse your shadows together. I kind of like that word. OK, so that is the golden possibilities and the purple vibes. I am going to actually make it a little bit more um, deeper and I'm going to go ahead and take the dream big brown and I'm going to use my, um, let's see, this is my eye smudger brush and it's a little bit of a smaller brush. So I'm going to actually find my brow bone, still eyes open and just hit the corner and the top, I guess, of the eyelid. I don't go too far out because I don't want to drag it down. So as you can see, it's just placed there. So I'm going to place it on both sides. And then I'm going to go right back in. So this side is just placed there. I'm going to go right back in with my, um, what is this, my eye blending brush. And I'm going to actually go in this way because, again, I don't want any color to go past this eye. So I'm going to go this way and just blend it in. And again, this is the Dream Big Brown. I'm going to blend up a little bit, but not all the way. But I just want that definition to kind of make a little bit of a smokier look. Um, so this would be like a night out on the town with your girlfriends or if you're on a date night or, you know, all those fun things. So as you can see, it has blended in very nicely. I'm going to go ahead and do the other side. 
And I'm just going to go in and blend up. I don't want to do the whole eye just on the corner just to give that definition. These colors are so pretty. And it's hard not to just use this palette every day. And there's so much more that you can do with it, which you will see later on tonight. So I'm going to continue to blend this side. Okay. Now, got that in. I'm going to go back with my all over brush and then get the golden possibilities one last time and then just hit the corners of my eyes right here just to give a little bit more brightness. There. So what do you guys think so far? Okay, and I'm going to now line it up. So I'm going to take my, what is this, my um, waterproof eyeliner, and I'm going to do my top lid here. And I just go all across the, the lash line here. I don't go too far down because I don't want to drag the eye down. And I am just make a thin line in the corner. And then I just drag it out a little bit. Sorry, I'm looking in another mirror. <laughs> Okay, there's one. And do the other side. I love this waterproof eyeliner because I kind of have watery eyes. I'm always smiling and laughing and my eyes water. And also I feel like it's just allergies. And I'm in Michigan and it's cold. So the cold water or the cold weather makes my eyes water too. So the waterproof really helps me a lot. Okay, another thing. I totally forgot one other thing with this eyeshadow. And let me finish this eye here. Okay, so have eyeshadow or eyeliner up there. I'm actually going to take a little a smaller brush. This is another brush that Mary Kay had gave us a couple of years ago. Um, and it's a little thin, um, it's a feather, I guess feathers on the bottom, I don't know what you call it. I'm going to take the purple vibes and I am actually going to go underneath my eye here to kind of make a little of an eye line. And I go all the way across the eyes. I hope everyone can see very well. My lighting is a little crazy tonight. I called this feathers. I don't know what you call it. Bristles, I guess. The synthetic hairs on the brush. <laughs> okay, so I took the purple vibes underneath my um, lash line on the bottom. And I'm also going to take the Dream Big Brown just on the corner. And that also gives your eye a little bit more depth. Hopefully it's coming together for you. Okay, there, now. I'm going to go with my black eyeliner and I'm just going to do a little bit of lining underneath and I don't drag it all the way across just towards the middle just to kind of open the eye. There. My eyes are starting to water again. Okay, there we go. And finally, you cannot have the cake without the icing. So I am going to put my mascara on and I'm going to use the ultimate mascara and I have a little trick I'm gonna do after I do this. So I'm gonna put my mascara on my ultimate, which is one of my favorite ones. I mean, once mascara is on, like you're ready. This is one of the things that you need when you're on the beach if you cannot have anything else. Got to have that mascara for the fish, right? And the whales and the sharks. Make the sharks run away with the mascara. Just kidding. <laughs> okay, so here's all the coats on one eye. Let's go to the other. 
other side. This is like one of my favorite looks because if you have brown eyes and you wear the purple, the purple vibes, it really pops that eye color out, literally. It's one of my favorite, favorite colors to wear. And you really don't have to like match your colors with anything. I mean, if you're feeling bold that day, put the color on and rock with it and have the confidence, like Lauren said, and you're good. Okay, so this is the ultimate mascara. And then I'm actually going to go over it because I told you guys several times that my eyes water with the waterproof mascara. So I don't have problems throughout the day or throughout the evening when I'm hanging with my Mary Kay ladies, my Mary Kay sisters, and we're laughing and having a good time. So I'm going to go over it with my waterproof mascara because there is no rules into wearing mascara and having to wear just one particular type. I like how the ultimate mascara, it gives the fullness and the waterproof gives the length as well as keeping me uh, from having an issue with my watery eyes. And I'm just going to hit the bottom a little bit. And other side. There we go. So if you can see, I did my eye look with this palette. I used the Golden Possibilities here, the Purple Vibes, and the uh, Dream Big Brown all in one. So I used those three colors. So hopefully you can see it. Let me know what you think. Yay. <laughs> Hi, Lauren. <laughs> oh, that was awesome, Jody. I love it. Thank um, you. So pretty. Okay, Thank I can't you. wait to hear the rest that you're going to do with the, the rest of it. <laughs> oh, yes. I know. Oh, we are not finished. Yeah, it's going to be so <laughs> awesome. Okay, well, I'm real excited because um, I'm doing a totally different look for you guys, and I do love that purple. I do not have brown eyes. I have blue eyes, and I wear purple anyway, um, but usually browns um, and warm hues uh, will bring out the blue in my eyes and make them really pop, so I'm going to show you all that. Um, so I want you to know, before, while Dodie was doing her thing and Shelly was doing her thing, I did prep my eye cream. This is our Time Wise Repair Volufirm Eye Renewal Cream. I felt like I needed a little bit of that, so they were moisturized. And then I also did a little bit of um, under eye corrector and my concealer color, which is a deep ivory, um, up under here. And then I also did a little bit on my eyes to like on my eyelids to prep them. Um, I do have a lot of color, usually like a kind of dark bluish, <laughs> like the the under eyes and it even goes, you can kind of see the veins sometimes in my eyelids. So I do put concealer up there. So I wanted it to be well prepped. And this, um, I learned that, well, this trick I learned from Lori Hogg. That was the glamor session I was on a little while ago. She's one of our makeup artists for hilarious. Um, so I'm going to, I also took a little bit of our translucent powder and the blending brush. Um, and so if you know, anything about glamour and makeup and stuff you may have heard of baking your eyes before um if you don't know about it she <laughs> lori uh, the makeup artist was like don't go google it you don't need to know <laughs> um, especially as we age um that's great for like maybe the younger girls that um really need it but but we don't so her tip was to use the translucent powder with the blending brush and then go here and just set that under eye stuff right here so I have been really loving that tip. I feel like it's really helping everything stay put. And um, it's so much little product here that it doesn't like get cakey or like stick in the little fine lines that are there. So that is what I've done so far to prep. Okay, so I'm gonna keep prepping. I <laughs> have one more thing that I do. Um, this, I'm gonna use this shade as one of our Chroma Fusion shades, one of our just like regular eyeshadows. And it is in Biscotti, so I am using this blending brush, and I am going to go in and just put it everywhere again to just make sure that everything is, like, the same color to start off with and just give me, like, a really nice 
based. Okay, I'm gonna put that aside, forget that, and go to the star of the show. <laughs> okay, over here to my all over brush. I'm uh, kind of gonna do what Jody did. I am starting with the Golden Possibilities, which is that lightest shade. And um, it is, okay, I don't know if y'all be able to see this, but like, I mean, there's like chunks of sparkle. <laughs> So I love Dodie's tip about that because it is like definitely chunks. Um, and so I go in here in the corner and I'm not going to go all over because I don't want this sparkle everywhere. I'm only going to do like here in the corner and kind of take it up. So I'm using three, I'm using three, maybe four different colors tonight. And I'm basically going to do like blocks of color and then blend them together. Okay. So do a little more. I do like a little blow because I don't want any chunks falling all over my face. <laughs> chunks of glitter. Um, so I I started saying this. I like Dodie's tip about like tapping it in. Yeah, because it's so sparkly and like I really want those sparkles to kind of stay put where I'm putting them. And it's so light, you all like can't see it. Oh, you can kind of see the golden right there. Okay, um, I have a little washcloth over here. So I'm just gonna like rub this in my washcloth because I'm gonna change colors. I'm going to go on to the middle one here called a bronze horizon and it's going to go in the middle and I am using my other mirror over here. I can't imagine trying to do this in a uh, camera. So I also have hooded eyes. So if you notice, I'm taking it um, above that I am closing my eyes and getting it on the lid and I'm not blending yet, but I'm taking it a little bit higher than somebody without hooded eyes would do because I want, when I open my eye, I want you to still be able to see it. Okay, and I know that it looks a little funky right now, right? But as Dodie said, you just blend, 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 blend. Honestly, you could probably put like any eyeshadows together and do anything you wanted and then blend it all and it would look like it went together. Okay, so I'm giving that a good blow, blow off, and I am wiping it over here on the rag. Ideally, I would have like way more of these. <laughs> the next, and these are all sparkly, y'all, but the next one is called Peach Daydream. So that one is gonna go here at the end. Okay, and Dodie gave y'all a great tip about being really careful how far you go. Um, you just don't want your eyeshadow to go down because then it'll make your eyes look like they're droopy. So we want everything to go up. But I also will tell you, can y'all see how like peachy that looks? It's like a sunset. I love it. Um, I also will tell you a tip that I heard from Lori and I think Lori had hooded eyes too, which is interesting because hooded eyes are not actually very common. Um, but she said, you know, if while you're doing your eye makeup, if you'll just turn as you're blending and putting color. And she was like, you this space over here that you can still be using for color. Um, you just wanna make sure when you finish it, and again, you could use the translucent powder or you could even go back and use like your concealer and do a little, uh, a little touch up here and like make sure that you've got, um, that it's only going up, up and out, up and away. Okay, so back to my peach daydream. All right, so I kind of get like three blocks of color there. And I'm not gonna blend quite yet. I have one more thing I wanna do. I'm taking that eye smudger brush, kind of the same idea as what Dodie did. Um, and I'm actually gonna go down here to colors. It's Sienna Skies. And I just want to reiterate, um, Dodie's right on, right on trend. It is really popular right now to just go with one color. So if you were going to pick one color from this, that Sea in the Skies is a really great color to just do kind of all over and blend out and you're done. I love the Sea in the Skies. It, like, it's like the matte version of the Peach Daydream. So when I put them on, they kind of look the same. Um, but I just want to put the matte kind of right here in my crease. Um, I do like a Pac-Man, okay? So right here in the crease, a little bit above the crease, like there's my bone, I can feel my bone. Only because I have hooded eyes is that's why I'm going up that high. And I kind of drag it a little along my lash line. And then I also 
on my bottom lash line just a little bit um so you give me to like bring it all together okay and i know it looks a little scary right now but don't worry because we're gonna blend i also do think that the down up uh, the uh dream big <laughs> i was about to say downtown brown that's my lip color um dream big brown i also think that would work really well under here too okay now i'm gonna go back and we're gonna blend um i am gonna get a little dot of this biscotti on here just to help blend everything together and i'm being like ever so light and you want to use circles okay circular motions are gonna help like diffuse and down here, stay up. I love this, y'all. It's so pretty. It looks like it looks like I have a sunset on my eyes. <laughs> love it. Okay. Okay. A couple other things, real quick. Um, I did not do my brows, so I did want to mention brows. I use our um brow liner precision brow liner it is in dark blonde and here's another tip for you your eyebrows are um sisters not twins which is funny because i have twins and even twins aren't exactly the same okay so they're not supposed to look exactly the same and from lori hogg she says uh, start with your arch instead of starting here instead of trying to make them exactly match if you'll start with your arch so i just draw a little under a little over i'm starting to get like grays in my in my brown here so it kind of covers those and it just fills them in and kind of finishes everything off so can y'all see the difference in my brows like you don't ever does anybody like never think about brows and then like i use that i'm like whoa it really doesn't make a difference i always think like am i really even doing anything when i do this but it does, it does make a difference. Okay, I also like to have a little spoolie to like brush your brows. Um, sometimes if I don't use the brow liner, I will use the end of this brush and like a brown um, eyeshadow and do that for my brows. Okay, um, I'm using brown um, eyeliner and this is our just, it's just eyeliner and crayon. Um, I used to like be one of the people that like pulled their eye. So please try not to do that. This liner, um, it is really smooth. Like it'll go on without you pulling your eye. I promise. Hard to talk while putting eyeliner on. And another tip that I got the other day is called tight lining. So it's not your waterline. And she told us to actually like open your eye here and push, but I don't want to do that because I just put eyeshadow on. Um, but it's like going in here and I I think I can I can get it done without pushing on my eyelid. But if you push on your eyelid, it kind of pops out that bottom part of your eyelid. So it's not your waterline, which I, I've done waterline before. I kind of stick it in here and close my eye and just go. But what the tight line is, is actually like getting the eyeliner in between like all of my lashes. And it just is so great. Um, I used to have like a gap, like you could tell between my eyeliner and my lashes. And that has really helped. And then I also will do a little on the bottom. Now that um, Sienna Skies is down there too. So I don't want to get like too heavy handed, but just a little bit to make them pop more. And then I'm finishing mine with um, Ultimate Mascara also. Loved your tip, Dodie, about using multiple mascaras. Like, why just use one? I don't know why that thought has never crossed my mind before. Um, but I'm blessed with pretty great lashes. And so um, I also really love um, our Lash Love. I like the brush, how it, like, separates your lashes. Um, but then I started using Ultimate and I was like, well, dang, I really like this one too. <laughs> uh, this one really like volumizes. So. Now I'm gonna do one other thing before I hop off. I, I want a little, my lips feel dry. <laughs> so I am putting on this. 
This is our um, Satin Lips Balm. And I have got my uh, medium, I think this is medium nude lip liner. After, now that it's fall, I'm probably gonna have to switch to a light nude. I got a nice tan this summer. <laughs> so I was like beige, but I'm gonna go back to ivory soon. I do have really small lips, so um, I try and like barely get outside of them. Okay, I'm doing that because I wanted to show y'all. Oh, here it is. I wanted to show y'all my, since my eyes are a little bit lighter than Dodie's, um, and she's gonna go finish the rest of us here in a second, like cheeks and everything. I feel like this right here needs a little more blending. Hold on. It doesn't, like on camera, it looks weird, but on my mirror, it doesn't. I don't know. Anyway, I'm so excited about this color, you guys. This is Downtown Brown. It used to be a super popular color. It went away. Everyone was so sad and asked for it all the time. Like I've met so many people in my seven years that have asked me for a downtown brown and I had to be like, oh, we don't have that anymore. But they brought the pigment back, but updated the um, formula. And so, yeah, these are so popular. And it's so pretty, like such a pretty fall color. And if it's a little dark for you, they all with it, which I didn't grab. Anyway, but I like to add a little bit of the nude, like here in the middle, and um, it just tones down the brown. So, okay, so I'm dying to have some cheats on. So um, let's bring Dodie back and let her finish our look. Lauren, you look amazing. Your eyes are popping. That blue is like so pretty. You did good. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> We're going to go somewhere. Let's meet halfway. No, right. What's in the middle? <laughs> Okay, so I am going to finish and contour my face with the palette. And I'm gonna go in with the Dream Big Brown. And I'm gonna use this as my darker contour. So I'm gonna put it in. And I do the blow thing like Lauren does too. It seems to get it off. And I'm gonna go underneath my um, jawbone here and not too far down. So I'm just gonna kind of tap it in just a little bit and just give that definition. I'm gonna blend it up a bit and softly like I'm holding my brush kind of like really just getting it in there and, and not like like pushing it in so just kind of softly putting it in and then just because I already have some of that on here I'm going to also do up here you don't want to like close that right here because you want to keep all this bright so you just do here and then on at the top of your forehead depending on how much you feel like you need to contour there and blend it And then across my jaw, jawline down here. So you can see a difference there. All right, and I'm going to go ahead and do the other side really quickly. Be respectful of you guys' time. This palette does everything, I'm telling you. And just like Shelly said, you can. Just put it in your pocket. You have a vacation coming up just for really quick on a weekend, get away. Take your palette, take your brushes, you're good. Take your downtown brown and you're good. Or the nude, which I will show you here shortly. And you have like a light bag. <laughs> okay, so contour is on. I'm gonna go ahead and highlight. Excuse me. And I'm going to use the Golden Pop. Actually, I'm going to use the um, uh, the Bronze Horizon. And I just tap it on here just to give a little bit of a highlight. And I'm just going to kind of like tap it up here and just go around my eye like a little C. And my, above my cheekbone. Just to give that little bit of a sparkle. I love this palette. And I know I say it too much, but I do. You guys, everyone needs a palette so they can love it too. Okay. All right. So I use the Bronze Horizon as my contour. The, um, I'm sorry, Bronze Horizon as my highlighter. I'm sorry. And then the Dream Big Brown as a contour. And then um, I'm going to put just a little bit of a color on my cheek. 
So I'm going to actually go in with the purple vibes and I'm just going to dab just a tiny bit and just kind of like go a little bit of above the apple because you kind of still want to keep everything up. You don't want to go like directly on that cheek. So just a little bit above the apple of the cheek and just kind of pop it on there and just, you know, buff it out. And I just, I don't put too, too much, just, a, just enough to give that little bit of a color. Get a little bit on the nose there and contour down if you want to do like your nose. Okay, and the finishing touch, see how good that looks? The finishing touch is the lip color. So I'm going to use my medium nude lip liner just like Lauren did. I like this color. It goes a lot with... Um, most skin colors, skin tones. Um, I really like it because it's soft because I have like more of a, I guess, a glammed up eye and face. I need to soften it up the lips. Let me go ahead and get this on here. And I usually line on the line of my lips because I kind of like more of a poutier look. And I kind of go down here and make like an X in the, the bow. Is that, I don't know what you call that middle part, but the, the bow part of your lip, I guess, the little heart part. Blend it in. Cupid's bow, yes. And I'm going to take my um, subdued nude. And the, another reason why I line is because if I, with my skin tone, if I just put the subdued nude on, it kind of like all goes together. So I need to line just to break it apart. And I just hit the middle. And it's on. And we're all ready to go. Let my hair down <laughs> and make like the, the full look, the full glam. And we're ready. Yay. <laughs> okay, Dodie, I totally contoured and highlighted with you. And Yay. here I was, and I mean, y'all look, it looks great. Like even it on does. my skin tone, you just use a little bit of a lighter hand and blend, right? It's always Yes. Good. Definitely. Um, and I'm so glad that you picked the purple because I was totally thinking, I wonder if I could get and I think it looks great. And it's so funny because right before we started, I was saying that I was I was liking our cream blush color from this summer. And it's this oh, like yeah. purpley color. So I mean, yeah. it's right the same. Like, why not just only pack one thing? Exactly. <laughs> yes. Like this palette does everything. <laughs> it does everything. Like you have five minutes to get your bag together. You're yeah. good. <laughs> and then and then yeah. Love it. So fun. Love it. I love you. I love your lip color, Lauren. It looks really, really good on you. It just kind of like brings everything out, you know, and of course it like brings your, your eyes out too. It's so, so pretty. Yeah. I like that you're contoured too. I love it. You can tell a big difference from just the, the other screen. So sweet, sweet. Okay. Hey, you guys, that's funny. Y'all were complimenting each other. <laughs> And I, my my intent was to get you two up here and then everybody in the comments, there's no way to put two of y'all as big, um, but everybody in the comments, you guys show Lauren and Dodie some love. Does their, their look, their finished look, look amazing. Thank you, Sandra. <laughs> so we've, got, we've got Lauren here sporting a, li a little bit lighter eyes, but the deeper lips. And so we, on, we did this kind of on purpose, <laughs> but it's all, of course, from the same compact. And so she's got a little bit lighter eyes with a darker downtown brown. And then we, of course, got Dodie here. Let me see if I can swap them out with the darker eyes and the lighter lips. And so I love how versatile and just how, how many. And y'all, we could probably like take all their makeup off and they could start all over and do a totally different look with different shades, with different colors. <laughs> so it is, it's beautiful. It's fun. Um, and like they said, everything all in just one palette. <laughs> so all of you guys, Lauren, do you have your compact there? I was going to say, hold it up 
And you guys, this is the first special of the night or the first, um, I guess, you know, I guess it's a special, but it's your compact tonight. It's our warm hue, hue palette. Let's all say that together. Warm hue palette. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but it retails for 39, you guys. And of course, it's got all six eyeshadows in there. That will last you. Um, at, what's cool is it'll last you through the fall, through the winter, and even for springtime. Like, won't this be great for spring? Yes. Well, so you'll have to be ready for the sun to come back out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that's our first special tonight. So if you are interested and you're like, I got to have that compact or that palette, go ahead and put, um, you can type the word sold in the comments and uh, we will get you added into our sold giveaway. Okay. So that's the first one. The second one, you're like, okay, I like that palette, but I need a little bit more. <laughs> I need a few extras. Um, you can get your um, palette and um, you can choose which lipstick. Um, you get a choice of lipstick and you can choose from the downtown brown or the subtle nude. Oh, that looks great like that, Dodie. Um, but you can actually choose from any of our lipsticks, the palette, and then your choice of mascara. And so I was trying to type what you guys were doing in the comments. And then I was typing that I do two mascaras now too. I do the Lash Love and the Ultimate. <laughs> <laughs> and so we have lots of choices. We even have Lash Love Fanorama mascara, lots of choices. Okay, but that's bundle number three. You get those three items and it's actually $16 off. So you get it for $57. Oh, that looks a little weird, but it's $57 there for that, that special. <laughs> Okay, and then the last one, if you're like, okay, that was pretty good, but I need a few extras. So you get all of those. You get your compact. You get your lipstick of choice. You get mascara of choice. And then you're going to throw in your eyeliner of choice. I don't know if you guys have all that to hold up. And then we're also going to throw in your CC cream, of course, to have that gorgeous complexion before you start. <laughs> so with this particular a special deal, you guys, it's um, you get $31 off and you get all that bundled together for 92. So you can put special one, special two, spe oh, that looks great, Lauren. Hold that back up and let me swap you out to put that in the front there. <laughs> well, well, <there's> Arvana. <laughs> all of that, you guys, for 92, $31 off. Um, great deal, you guys. And that is like all your color. Like that's all you need. <laughs> <laughs> that is all that you need. So post um, or, or comment sold if, you, if you're interested in, in special one, two, or three. Okay, awesome. Do you guys have any questions? Let me check the comments. Any last minute questions? Um, what if you want just two eyeshadows? <laughs> well, that's, that's really funny, Sarah, that you asked that because that's actually kind of what we're known for <laughs> is that we do have, um, we do have compacts and they're all refillable. There's Lauren's refillable compact, compact. So you can actually buy individual colors of our eyeshadows. They're all chroma fusion and you just replace the one eyeshadow whenever you run out. And so it was really funny because that's that's what we're known for. <laughs> but we were so excited to actually get a palette. <laughs> so this one, you can't pick these actual colors by themselves. Um, they all just come together. So you either get six or none. <laughs> um, but we do have shades in our regular line that are similar, but they're not as... Um, pigmented as these, I would say. Like these are just very uniquely, would, would that be the right word, Lauren and Jody? Yes. Pigmented mm -hmm. for these yeah. Shades. They're like the, like when I was putting it on, I don't know, there's like speckles almost. Like it, they're yeah. very, I don't know, <laughs> shimmery. <laughs> sweet, sweet, sweet. Yes, Sarah, you can totally work a payment deal with your girl. We're, we're all about <laughs> payment deals. <laughs> Talk to Frances, let her know what you want and when you want it and she'll have it for you. <laughs> okay awesome well let me go ahead and put i'll put me back over here and we want to thank you guys again for joining us tonight i tried to put everything in the comments so if you do rewatch, you'll have our um the, co the colors and everything that they used <laughs> um you'll have that if you're re-watching later and um make sure and put hashtag rewatch replay and so your beauty consultant can honor these specials when you do re-watch ours from tonight so Sarah and Trista, um, and I think there was a Amanda, Amanda was on. So thank you guys for being here and commenting. So I've got your tickets in here. And we're going to do one quick giveaway for a Lash Love fan Fanorama Mascara tonight. So who feels lucky? Woo! Drum roll. 
drum roll. And Sora, and I sorry to say, Sarah, you are our comment queen tonight with the most comments. <laughs> okay, here we go. And our winners, you've got a really great chance, Sarah. Okay, here we go. She's gonna win. She's gonna. And our winner goes to Sarah. <laughs> awesome. Thanks for being on tonight, Sarah. Trista, Amanda, great to have you guys. And thank you, beauty consultants. In fact, um, if you're a beauty consultant on here, I would love for y'all to comment one tip that you picked up tonight that you can go like and implement right away tomorrow morning when you put your eyeshadows on. Okay. <laughs> All right, you guys, thank you for joining us. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Bye. Bye. <laughs>